Hi, I'm Erica George. I'm the Samuel D. Thurman Professor of Law at the S.J. Quinney College of Law, and it is also my privilege to direct the Tanner Humanities Center at the University of Utah. The University of Utah is in Salt Lake City, which is also the unceded ancestral lands of the Goshu, Ute, Eastern Shoshone, and Paiute peoples. It is my pleasure to talk to you about our center, its people, and its programs. I'll begin with our founder, an educator and entrepreneur, Obert C. Tanner, along with his wife, Grace Tanner, founded the Tanner Humanities Center, as well as a series of endowed lectures, the Tanner Lectures on Human Values. It is through the continued generous support of the Tanner O.C. Tanner Foundation that we are able to do the work that we do. I work with Beth James, Susan Anderson, and Katie Puglia in doing the important work of supporting the humanities in Utah and beyond. The Tanner Humanities Center aims to promote humanities exploration and engagement through three central pillars of programming, our academic research support. This is support for faculty and graduate students for their research and writing. Fellows join us in Utah in residence at our center on the beautiful campus that we have in the foothills of the mountains. We also offer educational enrichment programs. This is a gateway to learning program that we provide in the summer in cooperation with public school teachers, K through 12 or Utah teachers um, throughout the state. University of Utah faculty collaborate and participate in developing curricular enhancements to enrich humanities education experience. Um, by reaching K through 12 public school teachers in Utah, we ultimately reach thousands of Utah students throughout our state. More broadly, we offer public outreach programs. These are our lectures, our public lectures and um, events. We have a lecture on human values as well as a world challenges colloquium. And most recently, we've introduced Tanner Talks. To complement our lecture series, I felt it was important to have a way for people to come together to have sustained, informed, intelligent conversation around contested, challenging, or contemporary issues. So introducing the values em emphasis into the kinds of conversations that our society has found most fraught. And we do this with public intellectuals, um, scholars, public figures, and faculty, we invite them for open, unscripted conversations with our university community. Our inaugural Tanner Talk featured Professor Ibram X. Kendi, um, director of the Boston University Center on Anti-Racist Research and author of How to Be an Anti-Racist. Um, we were able to distribute copies of his book and gift them to uh, school children. Our Tanner Talks are also anchoring one of our other signature programs, HATS, Humanities, Art, Technology, and Science. Again, through having unscripted, open conversations with public intellectuals working on contemporary issues, we've been able to share information and ideas and ask questions about the values that are animating our technology, our science, and bringing those into conversation with humanists and artists to expand and enrich our understanding of both ourselves, the way that we engage with technology, the, the way that we are creating and recreating the world as we know it through innovation. Um, HATS is an interdisciplinary research organ group at the University of Utah that invites scholars from around the country and around the world to be in conversation on contemporary topics. Coronavirus did require us to adapt and as other centers did, we moved our programming online. Um, this provided us an opportunity as well as a challenge. Um, in the real world, we were hosting up to 300 people for our Tanner Talks, and we were excited to see that not only did we maintain those numbers virtually, we expanded into different audiences and new audiences coming to us, tuning in from around the country and around the world, not just the state of Utah. And I think this speaks to the kinds of conversations that we are having here and that we hope to have with you. Where are we going from here? We're going forward. We're going to continue to talk about equity we're going to continue to talk about the environment, and we're going to continue to talk about 
um, well-being and wellness and the ways in which humanities education and engagement can help us explore these important pressing issues of our time. We look forward to having a conversation with you. Please connect with us and thank you.